Hello guys, welcome to Synth Rist. I'm your host. I've been waiting to make this video for you for a long long time. Today I'll be talking about one of my favorite Rolex sports and when I say one of my favorite I mean top 5. I've had an opportunity to test and wear Hulks various number of times over the last few years and I want to share my thoughts on it. It's called Rolex Submariner Date reference 116610LV. However, majority of people tend to call it Hulk. Fairly straightforward reference. We can say that this is a normal Submariner, however, with green anniversary colors. The ceramic bezel insert is green and so it's dial beautiful watch to commemorate anniversary of the Submariner, a true icon that stamped its significance in Rolex history. The LV in its reference stands for Lunette Verte and it means green bezel in French. The watch feels completely same as a normal black Submariner, however in my opinion it is more, it is simply more pleasant to wear due to its green appearance. The color is much more positive and when wearing the watch on the wrist you can kind of feel the vibe. When you are having a shitty day at work and you feel down, just look at your wrist and with the Hulk on everything will become more bearable quite instantly. I particularly like admiring the sunburst dial each angle gives you different visual impressions and then you can notice the true green of the Hulk. I think after comparing different Hulks in the past, the early models I am talking pre-2015 had dials that looked a bit darker than newer examples, let's say 16 or 17. Maybe it's just me, however I do think there are differences between them. Let me know guys if you spotted the same thing or it's just me. Let me know in the comments and my social media. When people compare Rolex models they always bring up investment aspect to the table and as for the Hulk, this watch is significantly more expensive than a normal black Submariner. This model is anything from 11 up to 15,000 pounds depending on where you are based. A few years ago this watch could be purchased for around 7,000 pounds and not many people wanted it at that time. It's interesting how things are changing when we talk about watches. There are various rumors around Rolex watch forums and social media that Submariner 116610LV Hulk is going to be discontinued this year during the Basel World, a famous watch event. However, due to the outbreak of the coronavirus, the whole show has been suspended and rescheduled for early 2021. So for now, all we can see is a huge question mark. However, what I think is that Rolex is going to release new watches anyway, along with updating people with what's being discontinued via online channels, press releases and all that stuff. I reckon if I were to limit myself to only two Rolex watches, I would go for a Rolex GMT Master 2 12610 BLRO Pepsi, the new Pepsi with Jubilee bracelet and of course the stunning Submariner Date Hulk. In such scenario you get a variety of complications, design and colors. With the Submariner I am certain to say that you get a bulletproof watch which you can take with you everywhere. It's so practical that you can wear it with a suit for formal meetings or with a tracksuit when you are walking your dog or being on holiday. Standard 300 meters of water resistance and the movement which is really hard to complain about because there is very little that can happen to it provided that you wear it often and look after it. After all watches are meant to be worn and enjoyed and the Rolex Submariner Date Hulk reference 116610LV seems to be a perfect companion. Okay, thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe to Sin Through Wrist, and stay tuned for more. Bye.